Hello, 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 and welcome to another stunning episode of Game with New Moon. Today, we are going to be continuing on Tales of Symphonia, which, uh, we did a little bit of exploration, um, last time, and we made it to Isolde, um, but I, uh, kind of want to go and explore it a little bit more before we continue the storyline. Um, there's a few things I want to go, or go and do, um, that's in, uh, was it Lewin and Hema, I think. So I want to do those two before I leave this side of the continent and go and continue the story. Because there's uh, quite a bit left to do in this game. Um, I want to try and get each section done. Probably level grind a little bit as well. Um, I did get my butt handed to me in the first temple of the game. Well, okay, first official temple of the game. I'm not really counting the uh, Temple of Martell, which is at the beginning. It was kind of like the tutorial for the whole game. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do that and then see where we'll head from there. So just bear with me for a second while I go and switch my monitor over to <laughs> the uh, other HDMI. So I'm not staring at a computer screen trying to play a game. I mean, that would be kind of challenging, but... Uh, I much rather play the game on the big screen rather than relying on the little one. Hello. There we go. Oh, for crying out loud, you stupid computer. It's more accurate to say stupid monitor. There we go. Ah, it's much better. Okay. So here we go, feel free to chit chat with me. Although, uh, before I do anything, I got a few shout outs to do. Um, I kind of got hyper fixated on things on Friday, so I didn't really uh, do my uh, shout outs during my uh, Friday stream. So I'm gonna do a few of those. Uh, here, face. And if you haven't, uh, go on and follow them, you really should, because they are awesome streamers. <laughs> Actually, everybody in the Koopa Troop is pretty awesome. Um, I'm just going to do all the shoutouts before I commence with gaming here, so just bear with me here. Uh, I don't exactly have... Um, what do I call them? Moderators? I haven't really... Okay, hey, there we go. Um, haven't really set that up yet. I'm just gonna make sure that I post everybody. So let's that's the two that were on Friday that are totally awesome. You should definitely follow them. Um, and then we just got three new ones over the course of a couple of days. So we got the wicked one. Uh, boom. So let's. I did it this way. I, Twitch is kind of weird with underscores, and if I don't do it properly, uh, they tend to. Actually, I should make sure that it's the right one. <laughs> no, no, no. Go to the other browser. I gotta make sure that I spelled these ones correctly. Uh, this is why I have everything on tabs. No. No, I don't want to. Are you. Uh, Chrome, you are dumb on the phone. That's not what I wanted. I just wanted regular kick. Thank you. Uh, so it's. Oops. Underscore. And there we go. I just gotta make sure that they. Okay, so I was doing it right. Okay, cool. Um, I know if you don't like for mine, I have, um, I have underscores as well as, um, the wicked one. But, um, the way that you have to put in the shout out, you have to do the, um, hyphens. So, it should yep. Otherwise, it will take you to an error 44 one or 
part of the site and yeah it's kind of dumb <laughs> kick kind of needs to fix that or yeah there we go it's red senpai that's saw i saw senpai on uh um on june's well actually i should i should do it's june too well not it because hers is pretty awesome too uh, i got one more shout out here or two more really um and 69 that's that's actually kind of funny that i got i got them uh following me as well it's kind of cool uh okay so i want to just double check myself for a second oh come on i really hate iphone sometimes but that's i have to have an iphone unfortunately because that's the only way i can do my diabetic blood sugar check app um, there it is. It's true. I just want to double check. It's a, oh, it is underscore. Interesting. So it's June is the only one that actually works with the underscores. But yeah, it's, Hers is pretty awesome as well. I could probably go down the entire list of ones that I or of uh, friendly or of ones that I I've tuned in and go. I like this one. Oh, I like this one. And of course, as I am not going to forget because I'm pretty sure Nerf is already watching. Two zero five. Nerf 2005 is another great one that you should follow as well. Uh, but yeah, that's all the shoutouts. Now let's get into the game. <laughs> and do feel free to chit chat with me while I am uh, gaming because I do really enjoy the conversation. Um, on last Friday, I didn't get much artwork done, but I had a fantastic... Um, I find a uh, fantastic conversation with some of the audience, which is pretty awesome. I enjoy that more than actually doing the streaming. I, I gotta turn down my volume because it's a little on the loud side. Uh, I wish they had remotes for, for all the, uh, well, for monitors, period. Okay, so we're in Azuld. That's where we left off. Um, I was trying to do the... Um, I guess it would, would be called Simon Says. Uh, yeah, go ahead. So there's this mini game that you can do in Isolde. And it's basically... Not here. Um, it's in the next area. And it's... You gotta be in perfect sync with one of the cats. <laughs> and it's... K-A-T-Z. Um, one of these ones here. Um, so you... You uh, you go as Genus. And then you talk to this one. And they'll do a little mini game. So you basically have to be in sync with it. Uh, I think we're wanting easy on this one. I. It's kind of difficult. Because... The emotions change with each time. So you have to memorize what that is. Okay, so question, uh, music, idea, sleeping, blank stare. Okay, sleeping. Okay. And you have to do this 10 times. If you do the hard, it does. It does a longer one. There we go. <laughs> I did think there for a second. Oh, they're actually playing this one easy. Why? Oops. Nope. So if you mess up once, you have to start the entire thing again. 
Okay, let's try that again. On easy. Um, I can't remember which one you get. Oh, God. Okay, uh, this one's... Okay, so frustrated, silent, uh, questioning, idea, blank, and that. Okay. Oops. I didn't even get that one. Okay, let's try that again. Uh, if you beat... I can't remember if it's on hard or if it's on easy um, or one of those. <laughs> Go figure, it's an emo cat. Um... If you complete this mini game, you actually get an out, uh, get a title and an outfit for a genus. Okay, let's do this one. This one should be easy. Nope. <laughs> that was actually the perfect one too. The oh gosh. Uh, but yeah, it's... hello Taylor. Oh yeah, this game is absolutely cute. Um, yeah, if you... <laughs> uh, how are you doing? Um, just uh, trying to see here. Um, yeah, if you go through this, you can... You get a title with him. I'm not really going to try to because I really, really, really suck at that game. Um, there's another, um, another thing that you can do. Uh, I don't see any more dogs okay so we'll have to go somewhere else i'm doing all right i'm just kind of having a little fun here um okay so these guys basically they tell you whether you have an item missing um if you don't have any um monsters catalog they'll catalog it for you or if you're missing any maps that's basically what they do where's the dog um, if you go as Clut and you talk to little doggies, you can name them. And once you name all of them, I think you get the title Dog Lover. And that's a really neat one for uh, Colette to have. But right now we're going to go all the way to... Not here because this is where you continue the story. I'm going to kind of skip that because you go to Palma Costa with that one and I don't really want to go there yet <laughs> and I have I have the battling set for auto so I don't have to worry about fighting because I really suck at the uh, JRPG uh, fights in here uh, okay <laughs> nice. Yeah, no worries, no worries. I usually do my streams uh, Thursday, Friday, Sunday, Monday. Because <laughs> I, I thought, well, it's better to do things on the weekend and um, that way people are mostly available. Um, so Thursdays and Sundays are my gaming live streams I have to manually go this way okay um so <laughs> yeah um so the thursdays are usually my short games so like the one-offs that i'm that i like playing um right now i'm kind of i'm playing through dust and the leasing tale um this week Actually, I'm going to be playing a game called Iron Sword, which was for the NES. Absolutely fantastic game. It's stupidly hard, but uh, I got, um, what was it, RetroArch um, on my computer so I can play that. And also Chrono Trigger, because Chrono Trigger. Um, but yeah, I'll be doing that on Thursday, and then next Sunday will be more of this. Um, and then Mondays are where I play a little bit of Minecraft, I have, I kind of split it up into two parts. So the first half is, um, what was it? First part is creative on bedrock where I'm like building all sorts of neat things. And then the second half I'm on the uh, Koopa Troop uh, Minecraft server on, on uh, Java. 
and going and figuring out how to play actual Minecraft, uh, there has been a few spots where I'm like getting a crap ton of diamonds. I've died a lot in that game because <laughs> I'm not paying attention where I'm digging and I sometimes drown myself in lava. It's quite comical. Um, and then I have like three nether portals already set up. Kind of lost the third one somehow. But um, yeah, so I have like access to the nether already. I've got diamond armor already. I've got... Actually, no. I lost my diamond armor. I think. I either lost my diamond armor or I had to rebuild it. Um, I had to do some rearranging in my, in my little base. I'll, I'll show you tomorrow if you ever do come on. Yeah, it's a, it's really simple. Like you can bash wood and create your wooden tools and then work your way up to like golden and netherite. Um, I'm kind of still a noob at that game as well. So <laughs> I kind of like the aspect or the creative aspect of the game because well, I can build whatever I want. Don't have to worry about resources. And I come up with really interesting ideas. <laughs> Um, and then on the Fridays, um, that's when I do my Chill With New Moon, which is my drawing live streams. So right now we're currently doing a Legend of Zelda art piece um, from the uh, first Zelda game. So the really o OG Zelda. So um, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Um, uh, we just finished... Let's see, we did the old man during the first, uh, during the first part. The second part, we did the Octorok and most of the background. And then this week, we're going to be finishing up the background and doing Link and hopefully getting the entire art piece done. Because um, I'm moving at the end of the month, so me streaming in September is going to be kind of up in the air a little bit. Um... So if you haven't followed me on Twitter, definitely do that because that's where I do all my announcements. Oh crap, I went up. Did I go the wrong freaking direction? Uh, I think I did. Nope, oh, nope, nope. There's the cavern. Okay, I'm going the right way. Huh. Yeah. So yeah, I'm just having a little fun here. Uh, whenever I see like a new enemy, I'll use this item called the magic mirror or magic lens and that just tells you what the attributes are and all or tells you the information of the enemies it's kind of cool yeah um i'm working on updating my uh my facebook um facebook page yeah this is a jrpg Oh yeah, this is definitely, it's a JRPG, so kind of like, um, if you've ever played Vespera or even like the Ninu Kuni games, it's kind of in that sort of genre. Unfortunately, this one doesn't have as much voice acting as it, uh, as other games have played. So I've made sure that I have plenty of water to, uh, don't tell me I went the wrong freaking direction. Oh, don't tell me I have to go all the way. Oh, no, no, this should be, I should be getting close to Lewin. Oh, cr if I don't get hit by enemies and, oh great, there's a dragon rider. Oh, these guys are gonna hurt the kill. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, we're not we're not hitting that much. <laughs> I'm glad Lloyd has like a crap ton of health. Not so much in terms of equipment, but There we go. Let's see, did we beat it? Nope. Got a 10 hit though. 
Now that was only 678 though. Not much damage. But I've already gotten these guys, or already done the beast relief for these guys. So. <laughs> there we go. Never had, a chance. Never had a chance. Yeah, let's let's cook up some meal. There we go. So people have more MP. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I, I've tried Twitch and I, I did it for, uh, let's see, from 2017, 18s to, uh, to now. Well, till uh, about a couple of months ago or a month ago. <laughs> I only just started kick like in, uh, um, was it in July from around July? <laughs> Uh, I like these little skits that like, come up. <laughs> so I made affiliate in in kick on my fifth stream of all things, and right now I'm working towards getting uh, verified. So it's, uh, yeah, the Koopa Troop is pretty awesome, and if you haven't yet, um, oops. Yeah, let that play out. Uh, if you haven't yet, Koopa, there we go. If you haven't yet, definitely join the uh, Koopa Troop. It is an absolutely fantastic um, group, and they're not just for Kick. They're also for YouTube and and Twitch as well, helping small streamers grow. Um, and that sort of stuff. Yeah, I've, I've had nothing but positivity for, uh, uh, from the Koopa Troop. It's absolutely fantastic. And their, um, uh, Bowser does this hype stream every once in a while. And it is nothing but positivity. And you get a bunch of no, uh, motivational videos. And him basically talking about his life and the lessons that he's learned and passing it on to everybody. It's pretty awesome. Okay, please tell me I can go to... Ooh, this is... That's what I was looking for. It's one of those little statue things. Give me the monument. Oh, do I already have this? Oh, I have this one already. Cool. Oh, right, because I'm right beside Lewin. Never mind. So I'm looking for... Would you guys go away? Jeez. I need to go in here for a minute. So let's record Frank. I gotta figure out if I have... Oh, I got three grand. Okay, I got plenty of money. So we got, this is the end here, um, well, the end slash, um, item shop, I think. What I wanted to go is in here and see what equipment I can buy. Okay, this is customization. I kind of want to get that. The Sinclair looks really interesting. I don't have the, Mer uh, the Massive Moon. So I need white. A lot of white and black silver. I have no idea where to get those. Uh, and all these are like... So I need to get that one. That's a flying disc. I have to go all the way back the other way. There's a lot of things that I can get right now. Um, I got his silver sword, so he's a little bit stronger. Um... But yeah, you can go customize your things, and those are free. You just have to give up materials. It's... It's a lot better than having to spend your uh, your money trying to get things. Did I really get everything? Okay, so chainmail. I need two of those. I got fine guard. I think I got everything else. Ooh. Darn. Those are mega expensive. 
Okay, so we'll, we'll just buy what we have for now. And start equipping. There we go. I think that was it, wasn't it? Yeah. So we'll just sell what we don't need. Just trying to see. I know I need the Reaper for Mass and Moon. I need silver though. Oh yeah, right, I can make figurines. So there's different types of pellets that you can get for the figurines. Um, I haven't really found them yet. I'm kind of saving up the different herbs that you get. Um, just so I can increase my, uh, uh, my people's stats. Um, so it looks like I need more orange gels. Okay. We're just gonna go through this little town here. Fighting spirit, the item shop should be down here. Um, yeah, here's the item shop. Hello, okay, so we need five of those. One of those. I don't really care about these guys. I care more about the life bottles than anything. Uh, don't need a Palencia now. Okay, so we'll do that. So now we're back to being poor. <laughs> but I, I've stocked up on items. I'm happy. Okay, so is there going to be a cutscene here? Welcome to the Church of Martell. Although it's it's more of a chapel than a church. Yeah. So there's nobody going to talk to me about where this stupid mausoleum is. Okay. Um... So nothing, nothing. Oh, a new mirror, what? Okay, so no mayor has been joined. Okay, so this is a mayorless town. Yeah, so no lake. It's I wish they had part two of this game. Because there's a, like, once you beat this game, there's actually another game called Dawn of the New World, where it's like the continuation of this, but you have a new set of characters and such. Uh, I really liked it. I kind of wish they would have put both games, or both Tales of Symphonia games into one. So you can do the whole story, because this one's about... The world regeneration. The other one is, um, how can I put this? Um, it's about defeating the king of monsters. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> That's what part two is all about. And you, what's funny is, um, with Dawn of the New World, you actually start in this, in this uh, town. And just looking around, no puppies. That's interesting, no puppy dogs. And at least we have a save. I'm happy with that. <laughs> so nothing there. Okay. I know, I'm supposed to go to the mausoleum. I'm just trying to figure out where that is in this area. Okay, no, let's go to the, the mausoleum. should be somewhere. <laughs> Long range mode is a lot faster travel. 
but you have to find certain little uh, monuments in order to find them. Ooh, what's this? What's this like? Ooh. Don't mind if I do. It's a new land. I just don't remember if there's... Nope. No voice acting. Cool. <laughs> uh, let me grab some water first before I start reading out everything. Uh... Alright. Wow, you can go for... Er, wow, we can go for a swim. It's pretty. I see, so this is... Kratos, what's up? Nothing. I was just thinking, the air here feel yeah, the air, air here is clean and pure. Now that you mention it, it feels mis I feel a mysterious presence. Yeah, amount of mana is high here. Something may be hidden here. Hidden like what? I have the. Uh, I have an a key item. Produces beautiful music. Okay, so I don't have the the flute yet. Okay. See, so yeah, I have my monster list, which has everybody that I've uh, used the lens on, and a lot of them are kind of tough. Uh, where's the one that I still have to beat yet? Um, mm -hmm. Oh, where are you, Mimic? No, no. Ogre is a funny. Oh, wait, that one has that much? Okay, that one, I'm looking at more of the defense than anything. I'm like, ooh. I saw the d the attack. I'm like, wow, that's, that's a lot of attack power. Oh, where is it? There it is. So yeah, this thing is impossible impossible to beat until you get a certain level of attack power. Um, because it has 250 defense. And any weapon that's lower than 250 does no damage. And I think right now I have... What? Uh, yeah, 300 attack. So yeah. We're, we're hitting, like... Kratos and, and Lloyd here definitely have enough to attack. <laughs> it looks easy though. It, I, I got my butt handed to me uh, a few times while trying to fight that mimic. And there's a harder version. And then um, there's an enemy called the Sword Dancer. And he comes in three different flavors. So his first attack, or first is, actually, I think I have him. Hello, go to the items, thank you. Uh, there it is, Sword Dancer. So 8,800 uh, HP, 75 defense, and 600 attack. Like, I got my butt handed to me <laughs> quite, quite a bit. And, uh, yeah, it is very much ouch. And until you go to... Um, until you go to Palma Costa, this guy will be in the cave. He's weak against light, of all things, which I'm kind of glad, but I would have to go all the way back. Oh, hey, there's a church motel. Sorry. House of Salvation. Eh, same thing. Oh, Dougie. Uh, Colette, your turn. This is what I mean by... You get to name all the animals. This name is Man er, Manon? Man Manmon? Oh Monmon. There we go. <laughs> it is a uh Noish is really cute. He's kinda like a horse size Great Dane. <laughs> um you actually get to learn a little bit of his origins later in the game. So, okay, so we're relaxing. 
going back to Lloyd because that's the main character. Yeah, I know. The City of Hope. Uh, right now, it's kind of the City of Despair. It's not really... Legends has it that a unicorn lives in this... Oh, right. Uh, it seems the unicorn will appear before a pure maiden. They say sometimes the the visage of the unicorn appears on the surface of Lake Umsi. Okay. So that's why there was that weird aura. Okay. Cool. I have... N Do I have money? I have no money. Okay, so I need to fight in order to heal here. Okay. Um, usually these places cost like 100, 100 gold to... Uh... Okay, where is that again? Uh, okay. Recommend Asgard. Fuse ends too. Okay, so... The Belcroft place. That's where we're... Or where I'm trying to get to. Um, so they're saying it's... Oh, there it is. The, <laughs> there's the... There's the town of... Actually, let's go after some enemies. Um, I need money. So, I'm going to, uh... Try and get... Oh, great. It's probably these guys. I'm trying to get some more money so I can get some... Better equipment. Hopefully I can get this one. First aid. <laughs> this we're almost done. I cannot wait till these guys are higher level. Don't overdo it. First aid. There we go. I mean, I'm getting a hundred and something experience. It's, I'm getting pretty good at uh, leveling. I have 200 bucks to spare. Do I do another battle? Uh, let's go find these guys. They're a little easier to fight. So what I'm doing with Rain is I'm switching between tactics and strike. So I'm able to get both sides of the coin. She has really powerful assist magic. So I want to try and gain both the uh, both attack and defense magic. So right now she has a cute, what was a cute and uh, where is her magic? Oh, there it is, tech. Um, right now she has, yeah, sharpness and barrier. There's another one that does, um, there's field barrier and I think it's called acuteness, um, which is like a field effect. So it increases the attack and defense of the entire team rather than just one person at a time. Ooh. Okay, so charge... She's okay. Recovers parties from okay. Cool. So we got recover. Uh, let's see who else do we have here? Oops, he's not part of the team. Ooh, cool. So we're gonna get an intermediate with that one. So that means once this one's done, I get that one. So we get different types of, or different grades of attacks. Uh, beast. So the beast is better than Demon Fang. Attack is leakable. Okay, so we'll, we'll do. Um, Tiger Blade. I know the Supersonic Thrust, which is the next level for that one. Beast Energy. Uh, slams energy into enemy along the way. That is his favorite. I'm going to turn off. That's a two slash hit though. 
You know what? I'll just keep everything. Actually, no. Let's do... Uh, how do you... Oh, there we go. Okay, so I turned off that one, so now we can use Beast, which... I think that's the... No, that's not. Right. So now these can't be forgotten. Okay, fine. There's Double Deep and Fang, which is that one, so I can turn that one off. So... I'm just looking at what I can turn on and turn off. Ray... Okay, Ray... Yeah, Ray Satellite is the upgrade for that one. Okay. Um, See so yeah, how we got a few things. Ooh. Why can't you use charge? Oh, right, because it's... Hmm. Not sure why you can't use charge. Well... Let's just go after some enemies, why don't we? <laughs> don't overdo it. First day. Bro. <laughs> never had a chance. Of course we never had a chance. We never do have a chance with fighting. Especially when we go against higher level enemies. <laughs> okay, so this is Asgard. It's the town of wind. Yep. The city of ruins. I call it the town of wind because, well, it's very windy. Uh, where do I want to go? Item shop, no. Sorry, shop. There we are. Cyclode. It, every single shop in this town is wind related. Are you customizable? Nope. You're type. Okay. Woo. Okay, so I can get. Okay, cool. So I can. Okay, how many is that? 15. 28. Thirty. What, 31? Or 31, right? No, 28. 41. Um, 56? Around there, 57? So I need 5 grand. <laughs> Great. So that means I can get rid of that. And anything else I can get rid of? I need to keep that, though. Okay, so. Ooh, you have a great shop. Ooh, okay, we can. He has a great shop and a. Uh... Okay, the Sinclair, I'll have to wait on that one. Beast Hide is usually easy to find. I still need to get some of that silver. Yeah, okay. So your defense? Your defense. Okay. Ring mail. I need to get more money. Okay. A lot more money. So I need that. So say fifty so it was fifty six before, right? That's sixty eight. I don't really care about you, Genus. 68, and then add 30, or 36, 20, yeah, 36. So that's still a crap ton of stuff, and I, okay, so let, let's go seven grand, shall we? Okay, let's see how fast we can make seven grand. <laughs> uh, okay, we'll be back in this town. Okay. So I six, well, seven grand, roughly. And that gets our weapons up to higher strength. Let's just put it that way. Come on, monsters. Oh, we got another. Okay, so we got another mountain to climb. Just 
half expecting things to come at me. Oh great, another stupid Dragonite. Okay. There we go. So you have the, the little gauge that keeps filling up, that's the unison gauge. So you can do like major damage to an enemy um, when the gauge is full. As you saw, I was just... I keep forgetting that B is the one that actually activates as the initial or initiator of the unison attack. But this is an absolutely fantastic game so far. It takes a while to battle some enemies, but I need the money more than the experience right now. There we go. Yep. Okay, so we got 175. Oh, great. That's going to be like, what, 30, 40 battles? Oh, jeez. Okay, well, we're going to continue on here. Oh, really, really, really want to get that stuff. If I have to get it one, one part at a time, I'll get one part at a time. Oh, hey. I'm getting better attacks, finally. There we go. I don't really care about the grade right now because I think I'm like at 70 something. Uh, what do we have left? Really wanting to get more H, more uh, stuff. We're at 13. If I do this like piece by piece, I'll do piece by piece. But um, I just want to get some more. I think it's like 1800 for. For the sword that I want to get. Please tell me I can get my rest of the tech. Darn. I was going to do item thief, which allows you to steal enemies' items. Sonic Beast. That's an interesting combination. It was, he says Super Sonic Thrust, I let he does. Beast at the at the last second. It's interesting. Very interesting combination there, Lloyd. I know the higher level you get, the more interesting techniques you learn. It's sort of similar to Chrono Trigger in a way, um, where if you use a use a technique so, uh, at, for a certain amount. You learn like the upper, or learn a new technique with that. Oh, please tell me we got more money. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, we got 1500. Is that enough to get one piece of equipment? Cross my hooves there. I'm glad I'm going here rather than anywhere else. I'll be able to get better or uh, better equipment here, and then I can go back. Because really, you're not supposed to come here till like later. Okay, let's see. Oh, we got 49 grade. Okay. A grab bag. Don't need that. I need these two though. I'm gonna have to spend grade, aren't I? So I need two, or one of each. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to need. So one of each there, a beast fang and beast hide, okay. So one of those. I wasn't done there, you strip it. Thank you. 
change the grade her thing and then we need to hide okay so I need the mirror or the mass moon so I can get that one oh you're the wrong one I'll do the defensive later I want the attack first And we'll talk to you and we'll customize to getting this blade. There we go. So I need the ring slicer or slicer ring or whatever. And I need the, I got the battle stuff. So one more white silver. One more white silver. So we'll equip Lloyd with his better, much better attack. Also, fume I don't think I need, so I can sell it. Oh yeah. <laughs> that. Uh, what was the? Okay, I need thirteen or er, fourteen hundred for that one. Okay. We'll do that one next. So 1400. Okay, let's go get that going. <laughs> uh, so we got one one weapon up to snuff. Still looking for the Belcliff mausoleum. So to figure that out. You are next. Oh yeah, that's much better attack. Okay, stop running around. Ooh, that was a good combo. Okay, just attack. 170. And I think I got equipment on uh, Lloyd and uh, Crotch's auto regen's health, which is a big help. <laughs> Enemies deserve no mercy. Oh, we got 200 with that one. Okay, cool. Let's see who else we have. Uh, let's see. Can we get more of those types of battles? Yes. Okay, I missed the mark on that one. Oh good, Lloyd, you leveled up finally. Okay, so in the forest that one's easier, but uh, you get more uh, more money with that. I do not mind. Okay, so yes, I'm going back and forth, back and forth, but it's one way of getting my equipment upgraded. I probably could afford to uh, stay at the end, but I'm gonna wait. Uh, you. I need to buy one of you. Because I need to go to you. Upgrade to that. Oops, I uh, want equipment. There we go. So we got that. And that's much better. Okay. 
Okay, so what can I... That's only 500. Okay. So what's our next one? 1500. Okay. I'm going to keep that gem rod once I get it. So we got the slicer, so we need... Or the mystic, whatever. So I need to go and get another, what, 1500 or uh, 1200. So it's five battles. Uh, I'm going to save outside here. There we go. Damn. Oh, hey, there's Harpy. I don't think I have a Harpy. There we go. Now I have a Harpy. Ah. So that's her using Recover. Interesting. I have the Chosen with a uh, Poison Charm, so... Lloyd just learned something. Okay, what did we just get? Yeah, we're almost at a thousand bucks already. Uh, what did? Oh, fear steam fake. Okay, so that that one's not going to be on now. This is going to be Lloyd's new favorite one. So when I get like a, a next level version of whatever, then I'm going to turn off the lower levels. Come on. Come on, beasties. Really wanting to get money. We're like... Now, so high in health. Ooh. Use recover, mate. Okay, we got two poisoned. Use recover, you idiot. Okay, you desperately need health. Is everyone all right? Oh, we failed to make a rice ball, so no recovery there. Darn. Okay, I need item. Also is low in health. You are low in health, and let's bring you back up. There we go. I don't care. About, I don't really care about him. Uh, yep. Yeah, I think I got everybody covered. Let's watch this. Sense of taste. Oh. Great. So, any more enemies? I'm going to. Four away. 
400 away from getting what we need. First day. Yeah, that's one thing you, they messed up on the AI for for this. Um, when somebody's already like recovered, like as you saw, like two people were recovering the same person instead of switching targets to somebody else who's needing health. <laughs> that's how this game used to be on the GameCube too. So I'm kind of glad that they they kept everything. Roughly the same. They did add some animated, uh, animated scenes, which is kind of cool. Come on! Oh, I just realized her, her um, Colette's little chakrams there. Her, uh, going all neon there. There we go. But you got a nice roll of rice. Or a nice ball of rice. Okay. Oops. We're gonna go like this. Drain, can you use recover? Thank you. Jeez. Okay. Uh, how far are we? Oh, we're at 1500. Okay, cool. So we'll get. Rain's new equipment. And it's not going to be the the gem rod. That's going to be a later a later thing. Open this me. Okay, buy the gem rod because I need that later. We're going to customize. Hello. Customize to the Earth Rock. Oh, right, I forgot to. Wait a second, I forgot to equip it. <laughs> there we go. So, what was the other one that I needed? Oh, the Beast Tide was the Falling Star. Okay. Oh wow, that's a good up on attack power. <laughs> 209 to 261. Yeah, that's a half decent amount of uh, attack power. Okay, so what do I need for this one again? Two ring mails. Actually, that's not much defense, but I'll take it. Okay, fine guard, she has. Don't care about you. I just need one. Okay, so 1200. I'm gonna get that one first. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm not gonna sell that because I can go to Hema and get that rod upgraded. So I need eight. It's 1100. 1200. Okay, so 1200 for that one. Even though I don't need. Genus all too much. I kind of want to have his equipment somewhat upgraded. Not going to focus on that too much. Thank you. Let's go to field once more. <laughs> uh, just me going back and forth, back and forth. Uh, this is kind of how you upgrade on the fly. It's just go to a town that. You have, ooh. I haven't seen that one before. Yeah, you big one. I know the little ones. I now I found the big one. Oh, great! Oh, you bastard! You're fine. Guy to mess 
And we got lots of mushrooms for that. <laughs> Uh, 135, that's not much in terms of XP, er, of, uh, money. Where's the other ones I like using? Come on. Hit it that the enemies are, like, random. Fine, I need more air type enemies. Ooh, you. Reinforcements, huh? <laughs> Recover. <laughs> Use recover, you dummy. There we go. Wasn't wanting first day to want to recover. You strip it. Ugh. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. Can we... Can we use rains to recover? Oops. Takes 12, though. Darn. Uh, okay, so I'll have to use a plant to them. Which is fine. That's why I have a stock of them. Okay, I only have two of them left. And I only made 200 bucks. Okay. Not that much. Kind of looking around as well to see if there's any treasure chests. Because that is a good thing to have. Okay. We'll go this way then. Oh, good. These guys. Fine. Thank you. There we go. Don't overdo it. First aid. She really does have a decent attack power now. Work. Sonic thrust. Enemies deserve no mercy. Ain't that the truth? There we go. Oh, we got we got another. Tw 200. Okay. <laughs> uh, I need, what was it, 1200? Jeez. Oh, I'm really at 500. Oh, God. Oh, it's going to take forever. Not really, because I'm kind of level grinding as I'm going along. Oh, great. Recover would be helpful right now, Rain. <sighs> Barrier is not really helpful, Rain. Wow, she's actually kind of badass now. Here we go. Okay. Now she can use recover on stupid Lloyd. So let's see. Alright, Fierce Demon Fang. Which is good. Terrible. So we still haven't learned any new ones yet. Okay. So we're still in learning things and stuff. First aid. <laughs> and the guy that uh, voices Lloyd in this is Robin from Teen Titans. <laughs> That's uh, kind of interesting that 
you learn to recognize the voices from television shows and like in, er, in games. It's like, oh yeah, it's this person. Uh, we don't need to go to Lewin. I want to go that way. Oh right, I want to go this way. And we're still in the forest, aren't we? Yep. Tripness and acuteness. Okay, let's try this dance again. Oh, you bastard. Well, I guess I can't do the unison attacks. No, I never stood a chance, but we're still winning. Uh, let's see here. We're at 1148. We needed 1180. So, still trying to level grind. Or not level grind, um, money grind. <laughs> I think what I might want to do is go all the way back to Triot. And, uh, and see what we can do. Maybe gain money on, on her way there. Because in the Tree Ruins is that mimic that I had a hard time fighting, and I'm pretty sure I get a rare item in there, so I want to make sure that I get that. <laughs> But I want to kind of equip up, equip up first. Uh, we'll run into this way. Yeah. Don't let up. So right now I'm I'm getting like higher quality weapons ahead of time, rather than waiting to the next area or to the next area. You completely missed that, Kratos. How did you miss your double demon fang on an enemy that's kind of knocked back for a while? Uh, well, okay. Uh, I want to go this way. 1500? Okay, so we should be able to upgrade Genus's weapon. So it's going to be great with that. That's what I'm mainly doing is just back and forth, back and forth with this, with this one shop. The Cyclone. So. We need the dual thingy. We need to upgrade you to the Falling Star. Oh, that's a big jump. 143 to 251. Yeah, that's definitely a better jump. Okay. Uh, anything else I can upgrade? Leather guard turn. Uh, that would have been... That would have been good, too. Feathered rope. Do you not have a feathered rope? Or do... Or does she already have one? She does have it. Oh, I can remove it. Ooh, okay. It's me for one second here. Ha <laughs> ha. White robe. Yeah, the yokai lets the... Er, this one is Machina's equipment, but I haven't gotten her yet. Uh, okay, so we need leather guard. But not have leather guard on her. I have fine guard. Darn. Should have kept that leather guard. Oh well. I can always buy it later. Okay, so what's the. Is there anything left? Oh, there is. I have a leather glove. I need black silver. 
exchange. Darn, I don't have enough. I have nine grades, so I need to get up one grade in order to get that. In order to get that black silver. Darn. Because then he's basically fully ready to go. I mean, we just have to get the ring mail, which is like three grand, but I can always come back here. Um, actually, I think I got everything else that I need, so why don't we just jump on Noj and go. Do I have enough for that? Oh, I do. Oops. Sorry, Noj. I need to... Need to go in here for a second. At least, at least I think these places only cost me like a hundred. Hope they don't cost me any more than a hundred. Neil. Yell. Yell. You play dirty with the everything, with all. <laughs> uh, let's see, hundred bucks. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So each one of these places is a hundred bucks to stay. Doesn't matter what. Get out of here and go and head all the way back to where I need to go. <laughs> Still have to find out where the Belcroft Mausoleum is. Unless it's this way. I haven't been this way yet. Oh, great. I'm on a bridge now with enemies. I think I already got the witch. I think I already got the witch. Did I do this soldier? I think I did, but I might as well. I have the items anyways, and the, it only costs like 10 her magic lens anyways, so I don't really care. It's just better if I make sure that I have items and such. Okay, no chests. No shiny spots. Where the heck am I? Oh, anyway. <laughs> Anybody has the upper hand and it's just giant they call those giant beetles? Those are ladybugs. Not beetles. Oh, good. 100 experience and 174. Yep, yeah, I'm definitely going to be making money in this. <laughs> Just adventuring around. Unintentionally getting into fights. Definitely going to uh, get my chair of mischief. Oh great, another stupid dragon rider. Come on. 
Yeah, for an angel, yeah, that is easy. For us regular folk, uh, no, it's not easy at all. Is this the aha? I found the spot where I need to go. Okay. Right now, I'm going to save because this is going to be a very interesting place. Make sure that I'm ready. In case this does have voice acting. Nope. Cool. Oh, it's huge. Of course, it's huge. So, this is the Bellcroft Mausoleum. It's as beautiful as they say. God. <laughs> this building is an altar that was there that was used to offer sacrifices to the gods more than 5000 years ago. Jeez. Later King Belcroft passed away and Professor, that's enough. What do you mean enough? Uh, it's just I'm just going to ignore it. This is why those with no spirit of inquiry are doomed. <laughs> uh, oh, hey, Pookie. Uh, I mean, Poochie. I mean, there's there's a dog named Pookie as well. But... Pepe. Why is Pepe here? Huh. Watch all the way. Uh, I'm... Ah. I'm out for a walk with my dog. His name is Pepe. Uh, please be nice to him. Well, of course. Okay, anything? Ooh, what do you have? I came to see the ruin, but the entrance is shut. Is shut, and we can't. Er, and I can't get in. Maybe there's some trick to it. What is in the chest? Well, I don't need to worry about money for a small bit. Yeah, okay. Are you kidding? I have to... I can't come here yet. Come on, Josen. Just put your hand on that pedestal. Are you kidding? We came all the way here and now I can't get there? Fine. Uh, all right, all right. Well, at least we got 1800 bucks. <laughs> uh, so we can't go into that pyramid as of yet. Okay, fine. At least now I know where it is and I can come back later. Because we have 2500. Is that enough to get what I need? Oh great, I got gained. <laughs> okay, fine, we'll we'll just There we go. There we go. Oh, come on. Fine, fine. Take this. First Like you need health there. Okay, well. Hey, we got another grade, which means I can get that other thing that I need. Oh good, it's not going to be like three rounds of enemies. Okay. <laughs> That's the one fear I had there for a second. It's, that is going to constantly get bombarded by enemies. So we can't go to the Belcroft Mausoleum as of yet. This is a dangerous oh great, we got a waiver now. Okay. That is an enemy I definitely don't have. Huh, not much in terms of health. Don't 
overdo it. First aid! Are you okay? First aid! Take this! First aid! I'm sorry. Dang it. Life bottle. Go. You know, you have Guardian. Why aren't you using it, Lloyd? You're just regularly, regularly guarding. First aid. There we go. Oh, we lost a grade. So we gained a grade. We lost a grade. Jeez. Oh, at least we bought, we beat that enemy and got some stuff. Yeah. Okay, Noish, we'll stay there. We'll, we'll be back. Noish doesn't like public places. <laughs> really hope I have enough great now. Yay, I have enough. Uh, was it black silver that I need or white silver? Uh, okay, where is the thingy? There it is. Black silver, okay. I haven't changed my my gloves since I first started this game. <laughs> oh yeah, that's much better. Much better defense. I think he... Uh, no. He still has the wood shield. I haven't found a better shield yet for him. Uh, is there anything better? I guess I could have gone now, but... Rare kitten mats? Nope. Yeah, the mage clothing I can get, but I don't think I need. Oh, ring mail. Ah, that's what I needed. Well, that's 1100. Five extra defense? Sure. Oh, right, I need three or two hundred more. Okay. Yeah, I'm keeping the gem rod because I need it for a thing. There we go. So yeah, his healing properties. I'm definitely going to keep that cleric's hat. Thank you very much. Now I've got everybody up in defense and attack. So we should be okay. Uh, let's try up this way. Oh, that's the cat's place. Okay, never mind. Uh, what are you? Oh, your item store. Okay. Yes. I need those. I don't need dark bottles. Oh, I got light bottles. Okay, cool. I need those. I really need to... I need to get those charms. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll keep that for now. There's another puppy. It's Hal. The puppy name is Hal. So we got three different hotels, each one having, or each one being more expensive than the other. So the first one is how much? 300? 200. 
Okay, so we got Vortex. I just want to see if there's any... Might as well save in here. I don't see any Wonder Chef, so we're going to go out here. So there's 200 for this one. There's three different hotels in here. I'm going to go check this item shop out. See what this is about. Oh, this is a food store. Okay. Black saute. We got red saute and white saute. Hmm. Sweet, spice, and bitter. And then we got egg, cheese, and kelp. Uh, what's for the rice ball? Okay. Okay, so we don't want that much stuff. Trying to see if there's anything out of place in there. Nope. Okay. Going on. Moving on. Okay, let's check hotel number two, which is over here. Um, yeah, I have to go there in a little bit. Rain is going to go apeshit because of all these ruins. The Shrine of Right, I know where that is. And we'll be going to it shortly anyway, so. There was not much information in there anyways. This is cave number two. Okay, so we got the Summon Spirit of Wind. Ruins are boring, yeah, of course. Ruins are kind of boring. Although to rain these places or these places are probably like a dream. Okay, let's go to hotel number two. And these guys, I think, are three hundred. Four hundred. Close. Nothing here. Okay, let's go upstairs. You know, one of these hotels has... What's his name? I think it's in the other room. At least I thought so. Maybe not. Because Wonder Chef can be, like, any type of object, so... Literally, it can be anything. Even bull fruit. Okay, so it's not in this one. So we've got 200, 400... Or 300... Yeah, 200... 300... 400. Uh, what else is there? Okay... I'm not really talking through the... Oh, hey. You. No. Oh, no. Nope. So you're the only dragon here. Okay. There's another dragon shop that's supposed to open up. Um, later. Oh, here's hotel number three. Do you think I'll be able to find what I'm looking for? Probably not. And you are... Oh, you're 300. Okay, so... So it's 2, 3, and 4. Okay. I thought there was one more hotel. Wood carving of a duck. I'm just looking through the different hotels just to see where the Wonder Chef is, because... He could be anywhere in these... So this is like the middle grade, or the mid-grade hotel room. Okay. 
Last room, let's see. Yeah, okay, so there's nothing in here. Uh, okay. It's weird that I haven't found the uh, Wonder Chef yet. Last hotel is probably going to be the right one. So we get the slums here. Oh, hey, puppy. <laughs> it's Murray the puppy. Okay. Okay, nothing here for the chosen or for the um wonder chef. Uh let's go here. I'm checking everywhere in this town. So you never know where he'll appear. Yeah. Talk about slums, holy. Here, Lloyd. It's a fairy tale series. Fairy tale genus, really fine. Let's see. Chronica Angelorum, Volume One. Oh, the angel's story. That's a legend, or that's a legend about world regen, or about the world regeneration. Yeah. Let's have a look. In the beginning, a vast and timeless tree grew at the heart of the world. From its branches grew endless crop of mana. Primordial, ah, uh, primordial, let's try that again. Primordial element of all life. Its leaves thrum, uh, thrummed with, the bound, er, with a boundless, vibrant energy. Mankind harnessed that, or harnessed that mana, that energy and, or, ah, let's try that again. Mankind harnessed that mana, that energy, and ruled over the world as gods. <clears throat> mana begot the study of magic technology. Uh, magic technology, in turn, begot war. Okay. Two great nations, Silverant and Tethyala, shared, er, shared not in common, but a bitter mutual hatred. As they, er, as their war progressed, it drained the great tree of its life and mana. But even as the world tree withered, mankind would not hear of peace. In time, or in time, their war gave rise to the designs, a race of blind and, and hateful greed. They drove the world uh, to its knees and nearly extinguished all life upon it. Ugh. This writer sure likes to use big words. Yeah, no kidding. Blame the translator, not the author. It was written in the Angelin and Angelin originality. Ah, uh, okay. Is there any more of the story? I don't see volume two here. Oh boy, that was uh, quite the read. Uh, <laughs> so there was two. Uh, there's two nations, and yet. This world is named Silverod, of all things, so that's uh, interesting. Let's, let's go to this one. Come on, Wonder Chef, where are you? Okay. 
So, no wonder shift in this place. Time to check the other spots. Oh, hey, next door. I wonder if there is going to be a second story here. How the heck did. Oh, here. Go away, they'll find me. What? Oh, I get it. The kid is playing hide and seek. So, nothing here. Okay. Uh, somebody's playing a mean uh, mean game of uh, hide and seek. Oh, hello. Okay. Nothing there. Huh, that's an exit. Oops. Yeah, I don't want to go with the exit yet. We're pretty high up. There we go. I found him, finally. It's the Wonder Chef. Okay, what recipe are we doing? Ooh, meat stew. Okay, what? What will that do? So you need meat and kelp. Okay, cool. Fairly well. And he disappears. I knew I'd find him somewhere. Okay, what's the meat stew all about here? Meat stew, okay. Small batch attack, okay. So it's the same as this one, but it's HP and temporarily increases attack. Yeah, I'll, I'll stick with the rice ball better. So yeah, I want to get more of these types where it heals both the HP and the uh, attack points. But I did find him, finally. That is really, really, really high up. Okay. <laughs> I knew the Wonder Chef would be somewhere in this town. Always is. Okay, so you have nothing to say. What about this guy here? What's in the building here? I want to see if I can find... I want to see if there's more than one of the guys here. Probably not. Okay, so... I think there's only like one per town. So we've done pretty well the slums, haven't we? Yep. Okay, so we are on to the next little spot of this town. At least we found what's his name, so or we found the Wonder Chef. I'm always trying to find or trying to look that or look for that guy. And let's see. <laughs> uh, oh, the Asgard ruin. <laughs> Lloyd, state the historical background of this ruin. Uh, um, well, let's see. It's the temple where Cleo the Third. Held, uh, held a ritual to offer a sacrifice to the summon spirit of wind in order to quell a storm or, ah, in order to quell a storm that had raged for a week that's it uh, have you learned anything at all or yeah uh, anything at all these past five years pe art and uh never mind What perfect form. This delicate curve is is said to express the flight of some of the summon spirit of wind through the sky. 
In addition, it is said that this stone is infused with a large volume of mana, and at night, although currently due to the winds, blah, 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 I can't read that fast, you drop it. Okay, fine. I'm not going to just read the rest. Ugh. That's going way too fast for me to read. <laughs> Any questions? Um, yeah. <laughs> You're not letting me read the entire thing. Okay, fine. What's perfect form? This delicate. Okay. Rain's eyes are all lit up. Yep. Jeez. Oh, okay. This is very educational. Uh, yeah. Gratis, what do you think about this? She must really love runes, or perhaps something happened to her when she was young. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that she, either she was dropped on her head or something. Listen, Linear, this is my invention, the Breaker. If we use this bomb, we can easily destroy the confounded di uh, dais. But Harley, this is a rare and valuable remnant of Belcroft's de ah, Belcroft destiny. We can't destroy it. What are you talking about? As things stand now, I should may be killed. What are you two doing? Huh? Who are you? It's not what you think. It's not what you think. We weren't trying to destroy the ruin at all. <laughs> uh, what did you just say, <laughs> Professor? These guys said they're planning to destroy this stage. And you call yourselves human beings? Oh, yeah, that, that's typical. Oh, oh, even the glasses, kid. Oh. I am a half elf. What was that, or what has that got to do with anything? You have no idea the importance of this ruin. Okay. Oh shit! <laughs> you you say you're going to destroy this fabulous ruin and the timer's going rain. Now listen, during the final era of Barclough of the Balkov destiny or er, dynasty, the ruin was Professor What? If you have any questions, I'll take them after the lecture. The bomb turned on. I said, if you have any questions, <laughs> I'll take them after the la. Oh crap. What? Yeah. Uh, woman, you flipped the switch. I don't try to put the blame on someone else. That doesn't, uh, that doesn't matter now. Is there a disarm switch? Of course not. <laughs> Don't act like you're proud of it. Uh, I guess I'll have to try to disarm it myself. Great. Okay. Hey, you're probably you're probably good to be able to stop the uncontrolled. Ah, let's try that again. Hey, you're probably good to be able to stop. The uncontrollable breaker. Uh, don't go around building stuff you can't control. Thurin seems to be unharmed. As of yet, it's a freaking bomb on the monument. Oh, great! And now 
You're going to get in big trouble. You there. Trespassing in this forbidden or in this area is forbidden. <laughs> oh crap. Huh? Oh no. It's the mayor. Uh oh. Run. <laughs> Professor looks like trouble. It's Oh, let's just get out of here. I haven't had time to study the structure of the... Just come on. Hurry, everybody. <laughs> uh, I wanted to study more of it. Who are those two? Uh, I wonder why they wanted to destroy the ruin. Yes, the ruin! We have to stop them from engaging in such foolish acts like trying to destroy a ruin. Let's go, Lloyd. Oh, God. Okay, so can we go back this way? Nope. Oh, we can. Okay. Uh, I know we can. You're the ones who went up to the dice. I miss color. May I please have your permission to study this ruin? There's an idiot. Er, there's an idiot just like you in this city already. Thanks to him, the city's tourism industry is on the verge of collapse. I refuse. What are you talking about? If you want to know, try asking uh, Linear. Okay, so we're gonna have to go and talk to the idiot. And I think he's from, or he's in the slums. I think. I think, I think. Yeah, should be in the slums. Should be this way. It pays, or it helps to pay attention to where things are. Uh, Lantern is up here, I think, in this one. Oh, no, it's probably the other one. Oh, no, it's right here. <laughs> you're those tours from... Ah, you're those tours from earlier. I'm a scholar. <laughs> Whatever, get out. <laughs> Harley, stop it. This is my house. I understand that you were the ones that stopped Harley and my brother. Thank you. I'm not sure stopped is the best way to put it they got her they got in our way it doesn't matter what you call it the point is the people of the city are the ones that would suffer if the if that ruin was destroyed but things are now are but things as wow but as things are now, you're going to be sacrificed. Sacrificed? Uh, it's the ritual in honor of... Er, eh, it's a ritual in honor of the wind spirit. Uh, Aisha... Aisha? Aisha? Was chosen for it. Originally, the ritual considered... Ah, the ritual considered of just dancing on the stone platform, but this idiot started meddling with the stone or with the stone dais as part of his research and opened the seal. Because of that, the summon spirit of wind, uh, a spirit of wind thing, awoke and is demanding sacrifices. The seal? Do you mean what? The seal? Yes, if you, t <laughs> yes, if you too, are researching the Belkov ruins, then you must be aware of the altar erected to praise the spirit of the wind. The seal really, yeah, the seal really existed, just as the legend said. Are you saying that the Belkov pillar, ah, hieroglyphs, are not just a myth? It sounds like this isn't the seal we're looking for. Rain, aren't you 
forgetting why we're on this journey? Well, it's alright. It's not as if it's completely out of our way. Huh? Yes, the black or the back of the platform Ah. Let's try that again. Yes. In the back of the platform there is a small indentation and that's enough. Aisha's about to be sacrificed to the summon spirit tonight. Now get out of here. Okay, fine. Yeah, he's in here. Yeah. Little kid, he's in here. Go away, they'll find me. Well, no, no. They're bored. Uh, whatever. Kid, you do you. I'm gonna. I'm out of here. Uh, I have enough money to do one of these places. Let's do the one nearest town and then we can figure it out. This one is 200, I think. I think they all have the, the save thingies, don't they? Yes, they do. Welcome to the Vortex. 200 bucks, sure. I much rather have full health and full stats, just on half chance. Please take care. Okay, cool. So now we're all healed up. I'm back to being poor again. <laughs> what else is new? Uh, <laughs> uh, here we go. I think we have to go back to this stupid place over here. I wanted to make sure that I saved up. Okay. If you're talking about the sacrifice, we're already, or we've already heard about it. Then you should understand, or then you should understand. We can allow, or we can't allow anyone to disturb the dais any further and risk bringing down the wrath of the summon spirit of wind. The only one who may step upon the stage is the sp summon spirit dancer then i shall become the dancer then it would be fine for me to go up on stage yes professor this may be our next seal if we if we meet the summon spirit uh, we should be able to tell it the sacrifice that the summon spirit seeks might even be the chosen of mana. I see. That's our professor. <laughs> you just want to study the ruin firsthand. <laughs> uh, yeah, th that was kind of deserved there, uh, Lloyd. You should learn to keep your mouth shut, Lloyd. Mayor, please. Do as you wish. I won't be held responsible if it costs you your life. Oh, okay. It's not right for you to, to have... Er, it's not right for you to have to take my place. There's nothing about it. No, there's nothing to worry about. Ah. <laughs> Rain, are you sure you're going to be... Are you going to be okay? Yes. Now it's time to change... Er, it's now time... Ah. Let's try it again. <laughs> yes, now it's time I change clothes. Would you mind? Yes. Uh, yeah, we don't want to see rain. Because now we have to see her in her outfit. Okay. There we 
we go. This is why I healed up and saved. I've come for the girl. It's not, uh, it's not, no professor. This is an evil creature. It's not the guardian of the seal. Here we go. Time for battle. Oh geez. I really hope that Oh, right. uh, like watching the whole thing. I'm like, oh right, I need to wind faster. There we go. Holy crap, ten thousand HP. Ugh. Yeah, we aren't clever enough. Oh, good. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, good. We got it. Knocked it down a little bit. Jeez, somebody's getting his butt handed down. Uh, here. Damn it. Oh god. Yeah, let's get it a away from the heavy hitters. First aid. Ready. Don't overdo it. First aid. <laughs> okay, we're at upper limit. Come on. Let's do this. There we go. <laughs> that was a good finishing move. Holy crap. The map of Belkov. And a talisman. Ooh. So we lost, lost one guy, got 1,400 experience. That's pretty good. And 800 bucks. And that is why I saved what I, or did, did what I did. Fantastic. You're a fantastic raid. Of course. <laughs> it was hardly a challenging opponent. It was very challenging raid. Uh, whatever. Now, more importantly, about that stone tablet you acquired. This stone tablet has ancient Belkov writing inscribed on it. Let's decipher it right away. I have the necessary materials assembled at my house. Yes, let's go. Um, thank you very much. <laughs> that thing wasn't the summon spirit of wind after all. Or blah, let's try that again. <laughs> that wasn't the, or that wasn't the spirit, the summon spirit of wind after all, was it? I bet rain and liner will investigate what really, or what it really was. Yeah, that rain is a half-elf after all. You can count on her wisdom. <laughs> it's like, no, you're, no, you're wrong. Rain is an elf. I'm an elf too. Uh, 
What? Surely you don't think I'd mistake my own kind. Her my own. Uh, actually, I guess I was wrong. Seems you two are pure blood elves. I must not have been paying, uh, paying careful attention. We should get some rest too. I'm exhausted. Well, after a battle like that, of course you probably would be tired. <laughs> uh, it looks like the professor hasn't come back yet. Are you serious? Uh, she's concluding research with Linear, so let's go get her. All right. Well. We fixed one problem, now we're going to fix the other. Oh good, I kept my money. What was the one fear I had that was going to lose money? Did I actually get a free heal? Yeah, everybody's all healed up, cool. So we're going to go back up here and... <laughs> You're still looking... Check the insides of the house, you kid. Good timing. I just finished deciphering it. The professor is amazing. She deciphered the complex, uh, the complex, Belkrev writing in no time at all. <laughs> Rain just gained another fan. She's quite the catch, huh? Uh huh. <laughs> It would appear that the monster was the cause of the calamity that afflicted the ancient Belcliff Empire. It seems that the summoner at the time used, uh, used Sylph, the summon spirit of wind, to seal it away. And then built the stone dais to suppress the calamity. In preparation for the day when its calamity or when this calamity might reawaken, the uh, he left this map in order to find, or in order for people to be able to locate the summon spirit of wind. After the after a great many years, people eventually confused the calamity with the summon spirit of wind. So. Now, or so you know where the Summon Spirit of Wind is located? Of course. The location of the Summon Spirit is in the, lo or in the location of the next seal. Wow, I wonder what the Summon Spirit of Wind is like. I can't wait to see it. Now we can finally regenerate the world. Regenerate the world? I don't know think of it. What was your purpose for coming to the city? You don't look like ordinary travelers or tourists. Well then, if you uh, if you know our next destination, we should oh, we should be on our way at once. Yes, it's likely the seal is inside the Belkhof Mausoleum. Okay, let's go. Okay. <laughs> uh, um. Well, please take care. Yeah. Eight. We got another key item. Okay. Uh, let's check our item, our key items here. So, the ancient, a stone tablet reveals the location of the seal of wind. This is the reason why I didn't want to go to Palmacosta first, because. I knew there was going to be a whole shebang that would have to come back here anyways, so might as well might as well do this stuff first and then go. <laughs> oh, it's 35 o'clock. Jeez. Uh, we'll go to the save first and then we'll we'll pause here for now and then 
continue on at 7 o'clock. Just realized what time it was. So we're gonna go to save, which is right at the edge of town. Oh, we actually got some of the story done, which is very interesting. So we did the Seal of Fire, now is the Seal of Wind. I think the third one is the Seal of Water or Ice. It's one of those two. I think it's the Seal of Ice. So yeah, we'll, we'll pause it here for now. So with that... I do want to thank you guys for tuning into this first episode uh, or first part of Game with New Moon. Uh, we'll be continuing this after uh, after we come back from break at 7 p.m. and go till 9 p.m. and and uh, go from there. So I hope you guys did enjoy this. And as always, keep your eyes to the skies and never give up on your dreams. Until next stream.